Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, thanks so much for clicking on this video. Today we're gonna be tackling that dark black hole under the kitchen sink. So I wanted to give a quick shout out to all my returning subscribers. I really do appreciate all the love and support. And if you're new here, what I like to do before I start to organize anything is start to pull everything out to cabinet so I can see what I'm working with. I've actually been doing like a cleaning, decluttering, organizing series. We're placing our home on the market, so I'm trying to get everything already in order so when it's time to move out, it'll make it simple and easy. If you like lifestyle, home, and motherhood videos, I definitely would hope you consider hitting that subscribe button. I would love to have you. There is a big black spot on the bottom of my cabinet and I came from metallic spray paint. And it's really important to put liners on the bottom of your cabinets no matter what surface it is, especially when there's any type of liquid they can spill. I learned this lesson not once, but twice. Throughout my house, I did not put um, any liners on because I was rushing when we first moved in here. But I learned my lesson and I don't want you guys to make the same mistake. So this is everything that I pulled out of my cabinets. So you will be able to see that I'm gonna start to group everything together. I'm gonna put all of the containers together. That way they're out of the way. And then I'm gonna try to start pulling things out of the boxes. One thing I will say is extra boxes and the packaging this stuff comes in, sometimes that takes up a lot more space than getting storage containers. So although some storage containers may be pricey, there are a lot of different alternatives that you can find. And I'll show you some of the ones that I purchased. So right here I have my handy dandy garbage bag and I'm just going through each of my products to see what's like empty or doesn't have a top. So I'm throwing it away and then I'm grouping everything into specific categories. So here are all my items grouped together. I have my spray paint over here. I got some stuff for like the floor and the rug. And my pods, dishwashing liquid. This is like all like cleaner stuff, sponges, microfiber cloths, um, bins or storage containers rather. So this storage organizer I got from Target for $18.99. I really love it because you can use it for multiple different things. So in my case, I'm putting my sponges and racers in there and you can get put other products in there, which is great for a small space. New tier organizer also came from Target as well. It's just a bigger size. It was $22.99. And this is also great for a small space because you can fit multiple items inside. Still I own and know I'm letting go. I'm breaking these walls down, breaking these walls down. If you want an adventure, then fly to home. But if you want to travel, then go alone. Yeah, what's the point in us if I never know? I'm now start to remove all my products out of their packages if I haven't already and I'm going to start putting them away in the storage containers to maximize the most space. So in my videos I always typically use clear containers and that's so that I'm able to see my items. I love these stackable acrylic containers that I purchased from Target. They come in multiple different sizes and they're perfect for a small area. <laughs> Finally, time to put everything in order. One thing I like about my cabinets is it's open and airy, and there's no wood bar in the middle. But I don't like that my garbage disposal and all the other pipes and water pipes in here are so far up in the front. Um, so it's really important to find containers that work for your area, and I feel like I did just that. So I could feel something else Yeah, I guess I had my bad days But it doesn't mean I lost my Darling, where were you When my heart was on the ground? I thought time would prove That you would stick around I guess time starts to A king without his crown Now I'm breaking
All right, guys, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. It is all done and everything looks so nice, neat, and organized. I don't really need to point out everything. Everything speaks for itself. The only thing that I do love that I found a spot for was my essential oils. I'm also going to get another container for the top of there for my gloves. I have my spray paint in the back and I have extra storage space over there. And then my Grove Caddy was the perfect spot for this because now I'm able to easily access it when I need to clean up the house. And it just looks so well organized, y'all. I'm so happy that I was able to do this. And I hope I gave you guys some ideas. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe on your way out. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and follow me on Instagram. I'll have the link down in the description box below. But I'll catch you guys in the next one. Toodles! I'm trying to find a home